What is up with this show, fam? Oh, she put that thing! Hey, check out our Patreon in the link below. You'll have access to uncut and upcoming reactions, skits, behind the scenes footage, and so much more. Your support goes a long way to helping us with more reactions and original content. Also, thanks for subbing. Set, Set the, the bell, bell for notifications. notifications. Your boy Rock Lee. Hey, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and do so. My reaction. Oh, wait. whose show is it? Is Deku's show? It's Deku. My Hero Academia, starting now. Hey, what is going on, everybody? It is Rock D. Lee. Direct the Nasty. Jumping into this My Hero Academia reaction. Yo, quick recap on the last episode. Toko Yami. Toko Yami. I gotta do it like this, guys. This is how I break down his phonically. Remember his name, we Toko were, Yami for dark. We were, yeah, we were literally just talking about five seconds. Ago. We're like, Yami means dark. Welcome, Yami. Because <laughs> this is what happened when I said when I was looking at the name Toko Yami, trying to remember it for you guys and for myself, right? I was like Yami, like Yami Yugi. Yeah. And when I say Yami Yugi, I was like Yami means dark. dark. Click. Yeah, 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 yeah. So anyways, yeah, man, we really had a big moment with him. Uh, you know, showing what he was working on when he was when he was with Hawks. Yeah. And you know, Hawks has that tough guy training where I believe in you. I'm not gonna hold your hand though, but because I believe in you, I know you're the kind of person that's gonna strive to keep up, and this is just gonna work. You know. It's just gonna work. It's just gonna work. But I'm gonna go on a limb and say that wouldn't work with everybody. But at the same time, Hawks knew it wouldn't work with everybody, but it would work with uh, Tokoyami. Facts. Yeah. Um, a couple other things that like we were looking at his whole gliding. Thing. I was like, yo, I, I could have sworn I'd seen this before. Yes, I got a comment from a. I don't want to butcher your name, man. But you know, you know it's you when I start referring to you, okay? But he's like, yes, he comments on every my hero academia video that we posted. Uh, we so did see it in the movie. Yeah. We did see it in the movie, but the movie uh, has, is a little bit of a spoiler because it has it's, it's it's ahead of what parts we're at right now. That's why we saw him glide in the movie, okay? So anyways, we're gonna jump into this, guys. If you're not subscribed, now's a good time to do so. The full reaction, full discussion will be on our Patreon. Director Nasty, hit him with it. Hey, hit the bell for post notifications because you post content daily and you don't want to miss out. Let's jump into My Hero Academia starting now. <laughs> Yo, my man has a scream. I like Naval Boy, man. Oh, I can rock the Naval Boy glasses, fam. Yo, I love this guy's movements, He's bro. drippy, bro. Yeah. He's one of us. <laughs> when he moves, he like leans into the movement, bro. Fluid. Oh, and they're everywhere. The spores could be on you. She could know every direction you are. Sensory stuff. Like, I forgot that they landed on objects, too. Oh, Invisible Girl is not invisible, obviously. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. And she just spamming. Yeah. She puts you in her dimension, fam, on some Jujutsu Kaisen stuff. Oh, and she's giving it freaking... That's some scientific word. I don't know what the hell that means. The more humidity, that's, that's why like, she had the lunch. Yeah, it'd be dope in Florida. Oh, so she does overkill for like, just because she can. No! Oh no, that's... Oh, I thought they had some type of sentient thing to it. Low risk. Oh, he actually considered failure. He's not as overconfident as you would as he came off. And put pressure on him. They really understand their opponent. This team here. They rival rivals. Yo, legit. Yep. Whoa. Is it the words that he said? With the burple? Comic? 
What is up with this show, fam? And onomatopoeia. So when he says sound effects, that, yeah, literally. When he said bam, that's what came out. Flying, bro. As far as I'm concerned, a deity is in control of who gets quirks in this show, fam. Because someone is having fun just dropping Yo, just random making quirks. shit up, right? Yeah! Honestly, they just stop freaking out about the mushrooms. Because so far, I haven't heard the mushrooms like suck your energy or poison you or anything. They're just there. It's, uh, so they're just freaking out. It's partly a distraction, in my opinion. Distraction? Oh, to 1v1. isolate Momo? Come on, Momo! Jeez. Nah, bro. That's why it won't work. Like, I get what she's saying, but whenever someone says that the lines backfire. Time to think. Oh, because she's the brains. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's so obvious. <laughs> oh, she had a moment of doubt? Oh, this is back in the day. Yeah, that's why. Yeah, I believe in her. That's why they asked if I was gonna turn my back on Miss Momo. Momo's definitely gonna come through. Yo! Damn, he's in show yeah. one for her. This predicament is still within expectations for her. She's a strategist. Right, technically right now, she's in a good place now. I think about it. She's just taking hits. She'd have to create nothing new. She got time to think because this girl's not throwing no hooks, yeah. no uppercuts, just straight hands. Oh, Kendall still respects her in this situation, you know? Construct a path. Yo, why yo, am I I'm spinning? Thinking, yo, that's yo, a shoddy, I'm bro. Spinning, fam. Show it to me Ooh, now. Girl, me too. Oh, ah, she put that thing! It takes time. Oh, she about to get that chest blown. <laughs> is this something that we wouldn't expect her to be able to do? You know I, what? You know, yo. again, it's the movie. It's the movie. I've seen the movie. I'm like, yeah, of course you got that thing, man. It's the movie. It's a high level uh, skill for her at this point. Oh, damn! I told you about the cape, bro. Remember that guy in Jujutsu Kaisen that's the whistle? Yeah! So oh. That's the weakness. Do you see At his least hat? there is one, yeah. Is that a mask or is he just, he just walk around looking like that? I think he just looks like a kind of bro. <laughs> They got two uh, highly intelligent people, though. <laughs> Mid speech, bro. A cannon, fam. Oh, oh my an entire cannon. Yes, That's I thought it was just like a yes, some Robocop yeah, stuff, right? fam. No. Bitches love cannons, boy. Yo, <laughs> it's like an artillery cannon, fam. Why are you so polite, girl? That thing's me. Oh, Yo. damn. The animation, fam. That's all I'm going to say. She about to hit it with a unibeam of steel. Naval boy? Ayoma? Oh, so why are you doing uh, like that? Why are you doing like that? Thermal, Thermal goggles? goggles? bro. What? That's just in the bag. A grab bag. Ethanol? Ethanol will kill. Disinf oh, the uh... You had already thought about this. Oh, 
Oh, they think they should see her. They already took the mushrooms off. She mad. Yes. Oof. Oh, oh just straight I hands. Heard. She took everything off. The Yo, right the guy sensei's uh, training program. <laughs> all hands, fam. <laughs> Let's do it. Sabbath? Hey! Crazy. Are you looking for darkness? Hello, darkness, my old friend! He just... He cut off his connection point and caught him, caught him like a damn yeah. Pokemon. Yeah! That was good. I think this is gonna go to another episode, bro. There it is. My windpipe. Ew, no, that's, that's what I was waiting for. She still got out of hands. Yeah, it looked a little too easy. It didn't look very climactic, you know? Yo, she's still on. Damn. Oh my God. I don't feel like I won't. So they might win this one and still not feel it, obviously. Yeah. You can't send Dark Shadow into your lungs? Class A lost this one. Aww. Oh, my boy Aroma. I can't say his name properly. I like how they're taking loss as still a form of its own winning. Yeah. Because it got better. Commentary. <laughs> wow. Yo, I really thought we were about to get two for three for man. They're like, nah, you good here. <laughs> that was very I'm alright with it. I'm alright yeah. with it. I'm alright with it. I'm actually alright with the loss. So I knew one A can't beat them. Beat all, all of them. them. Yeah. But man. This is, this is designed to show that one A and one. It's supposed to be designed to show that 1B is right there with 1A, Don't despite what you've been thinking all this time. Yeah. I'm going to go on the ledge and say, after we get through this training, whatever we're doing right now, we're going to have 1B have a heavy participation or whatever is to come next. I can't fathom what it, Oh, I guess it would be whatever Hawks is into right now. They, 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 it's going to blow up. Yeah, they gave a little taste big, of, yeah, right? They gave a little taste of it and then moved on. So this is the opportunity to connect with 1B and put some respect on 1B's name, you know? So when they pop up later and helping out or doing rescue or whatever, you're not like, yo, what the hell's going on? That's how I see it. True. You know? Because that's how I saw I saw him coming into this. I'm like, yo, 1B? What the hell y'all going to yeah. do, man? Yeah, we're going to do, yeah, I was about to do 1A sweep. And everybody's yeah. like, nah, don't sleep on 1B. I'm like, ah. But nah, they trying, they showing out, man. They yeah. showing out. I like what they did with Momo. She, it's like, it's one of those things where I guess Kendo just wanted like this flat out beat her, beat her. Yeah. But this plan showed that, you know what? It's as simple as this. It already started off with Kendo being physically stronger than Momo. So it wasn't if you beat if Kendo beats Momo with with physical strength, she already knows like that's what she's gonna do. Yeah. But when Momo showed that she knew she was coming with physical strength, she knew more or less she'd be out isolated, and she had a plan for it. It's just like dang. You you expect this chestnut checkers. Yeah, you expected this. So I'm just gonna still beat you with the one thing I knew I was gonna beat you with. So I think for Kendo, she knew she she had the strength advantage. She also wanted the mental advantage. Yeah. She didn't get that. Nah, she almost did. It was a good plan. I mean, they won, but she doesn't feel like she won. Cause like yeah, I, well, I don't know. Well, man. for all intents and purposes, it's, it's, it's respect to Invisible Girl. It's respect to uh, Tokoyami. Momo did her thing, man. She she gave them what they needed to, for the W. Yeah. Okay. And she made this giant cannon. Okay. And then held this girl, slowed her down. Yeah. Now at that point, I know it's a team. I know it's a team. I don't know if I'm gonna get slack for this. But at that point, it was up to Invisible Girl to e efficiently and quickly take out your opponent. Yep, and then go help them. And go help them. And Aroma, 
not to get caught. He got caught. Once he got caught, it became a four versus three situation. True. You know? So, and Deku said it. Oh man, I hate, whatever, I might get slapped for it. Deku said it. Tokiomo showed a new weapon. Momo saw that she can think ahead. Invisible girl, he never said anything about. Aroma. Ayama. Uh, Ayama, yeah, I butcher it, guys. I butcher it. Let me throw my glasses so people can forgive me. Yeah, Naval Boy, he didn't get the acknowledgement in this episode. So those two, in my opinion, uh, need to level up. But it's with all due respect. That's what happened in this match. The team lost, but individuals shine, but still your team lost. In the hero world, if you're an individual and you're excelling, you got you you got to look out for your teammates still because if this is real, they they're dead in this train. They're, they're just dead. captured. So no matter what, it's still a team team thing. So I'm satisfied with this episode from the lessons. I think that you could take away from it. And again, it's more than winning or losing, even though it's winning versus losing. It's uh, what you get even from losing, man. You can learn a lot more from the games that you lose than the games that you win. I've learned more from failure than I've learned from winning. Because when you win, you just think, that's it, I did it. Success, sometimes you don't go back and reflect. But when you lose, you go back like, yo, what went wrong? What'd I do? What happened? So yeah, some of the best lessons are from failure. Never forget that. That's real shit. So I'm hoping uh, from, this, from this point, we'll get Naval Boy to keep looking aside, what does he got to do? And for Invisible Girl, what what is she got? What is she gonna do? I'm, and by the way, I'm satisfied with what the Invisible Girl did. Naval Boy, I'm actually satisfied because he's giving what he always gives. He's comic relief and stuff like that. But every now and then, in a real life situation, which they also covered two episodes ago, they covered that Class One A performs higher in, in life, real life, yeah, and, than and these little training yeah. stuff. So we already see when this life or death situation or like the team's back is completely against the wall, Naval Boy shows up. You know, he shows up. Uh, just didn't do it in this episode. Like I said, it's all due respect. That's just my analysis and I'm cool with the characters. I just gotta say that. People are like, yo, I, like, I can't give an objective opinion but still like the people. You yeah? know? You got anything? No, I'm good. <laughs> Lee took it over, took care of it. Nah, you just spit, man. No, thanks, man. You I appreciate it, the man. The thing is, you said everything I would have said, but you said it in a much nicer way, so that's why I'm like, yeah, run that. I came a long way from the last season, man. Last season, I was saying- what You was on my energy. You was on that Black Air Force energy. Yeah, I was, but to be honest with you, and I still go back to old ways, but last year, when I, when I, when I, when I gave my opinion on My Hero Academia, I operated from the point of view of what I wanted, and because I didn't get it, then I would vent about my frustration, you know, more or less. Oh, why didn't could do this? Oh, they could do that. Now we're going to, and now after experiencing the overhaul and the, um, what's this guy? You know him, you just said it. Criminal, criminal guy? Oh, gentle. Gentle criminal, gentle criminal. After yeah. seeing that and understanding, okay, there is what I want, but how would I understand what my hero academia is trying to deliver? What are they trying to deliver? What's the message they're trying to deliver? Because this ain't just a shonen, oh, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be super powerful and just overwhelm my opponent. They don't call it, there's Naruto, they don't call this Deku, they call it My Hero Academia. So it's, what is everyone gonna be contributing to this story? So I just look at it differently. Now I'm done spitting. <laughs> Anyways, yo, thanks for watching, guys. If you're not subscribed now, is a good time to do so. Full reaction, full discussion. We'll be on our Patreon. Direct and nasty. Hey, yo, hit the bell for post notifications because we post content daily and you don't want to miss out. I am Rock D. Lee. I am Direct and Nasty. Out. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I'm going to laugh. Okay. If you haven't already, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on the bell for notifications, and check out our Patreon for full and upcoming reactions.